Jane lived in a small place with her parents, a brother and a sister. They were poor, but a happy family. They had a horse called Lucky, who grew up with them. The children spent most of their free time playing with him. But times were not so easy for them. The family found themselves in depths. They were trying to find a solution to escape the crisis. One day, a rich farmer came to the father and said, I would like to buy your horse. I like him. I will pay you in cash. In the morning, the father stood up and said, I have to tell you something. We have to sell Lucky. Our neighbor wants to buy him. We have to do it in order to survive. I am so sorry. Please don't. We can't live without him. They left the house crying. At school, they told their friends what had happened. Our lucky has to go. Why? It's all because we need the money. They were desperate. The next day, they ran to the house of their neighbor secretly. They entered the stable. Their horse was there. He looks so unhappy. We will get you back. Don't worry. We promise that we will do anything to get you back. But they had to hide as someone was coming. Anna's teacher heard about the horse. He invited the whole class to do something to help. Everybody had some ideas. I can sell my new PlayStation. I can have some money saved. We can all clean up in the hotel where my aunt is a manager. The local hotel was looking for clean-up staff. They went there to speak to the manager. She decided to help. She gave them some work to do. They all took part. It lasted for a month. Every morning they were there punctually to work for a couple of hours. Then they also started making souvenirs necklaces and bracelets with the help of their teacher and began selling them to the tourists. After a month they had enough money to buy the horse back. Their teacher spoke to the neighbor. The neighbor was sympathetic and decided to sell the horse to them for half the price. You see Lucky, we kept our promise. Even if you had to wait a month. Neighbor had a job for the father. I want you to work for us. You will look after our horses. The father was speechless. He embraced his wife and children. They came back home with Lucky happily.